Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Charles Young, also known as Open Thoughts. Hey, follow me on OpenThoughts.com. That's open, T-H-O-T-S dot com. Uh, so what I want to talk about is stop judging a book by its cover. Now, a situation recently happened to me is I had a friend, man, and I remember back in high school, uh, we always start there with a lot of times, this dude, he was just basically just a bum. You know what I mean? He just, he didn't have anything... Uh, uh, he didn't seem like he had anything of value to give at all. So he treated, you know, he basically did drugs. He did everything wrong. You know, I was cool with him. I got a lot of friends who had a lot of uh, crazy <laughs> mentalities, you know what I'm saying? And so I didn't expect this individual to amount to anything farther than where he was going to be at because in society we're taught that if they don't live up to a certain standard of living to... I guess of what society standard is, is that they're going to be a, a, um, a second grade citizen. And, you know, that's not true. So, you know, a couple, I've seen him a couple of years uh, prior and, you know, still seemed like he wasn't doing anything too special. You know, he, he seemed like he was doing some other stuff. But, uh, um, but I recently bumped into him um, a day ago. And, you know, I was talking to him, man. It was good to see him. You know, it was good to see the fact that he was alive, you know. So, and, you know, I, I'm asking him, so what is he doing, man? And he's got working. He's got a band and he's, you know, working on his music. And, you know, he started, you know, starting his career up, trying to win contests, doing a lot of different things. And I was like, wow. And I was looking at that like if this individual is doing better than he was before, what can we do once we stop what could we do once we stop judging individuals based upon what we see or what we think we know about this individual? You know, it, it, it really clicked in my head to say, man, you know, man, maybe I shouldn't judge everybody by what I perceive them to be, what I think they used to be or uh, what they used to do. And why don't we stop judging people based upon that stuff? Because it's not really actually helpful, man. That could actually be uh, an effect that limits us from working with that individual or encouraging that in individual. Maybe that individual encouraging us. You know, we keep always dwelling on the past of what's going on with that with that individual instead of looking on what they're contributing to themselves and society today you know now of course there's people that ain't doing anything but sometimes the very interesting thing is the best people that we perceive to be the best individuals might possibly be the worst a lot of the times we look at superstars and uh famous people and entertainers as these um these great uh, uh uh influencing people and a lot of the time they just like regular average joes but they got more worse situations behind the camera than than mo any any one of us you know a lot of them do a lot of drugs and a lot of you know a lot of stuff that has negative effects to them and we still believe from the perception of the movies of how good they are as an actor that they're this great amazing person you know so it's great it's great to see that i see people that i thought that would be probably in the dirt probably in a situation that <laughs> that is not um I, would, I guess I would have to say to to my perception you know of that individual you know it's just it's very interesting to see that and so that's all I really want to say is man stop judging the book by its cover because the words may have too much to say so I thank you. Hey, follow me on OpenThoughts.com. That's open t h o t s dot com on Blogger, Twitter, Tumblr. Um, all the uh, information will be at the link below. And after the end of this video, why don't you check out some more videos? Hey, let me know if you're enjoying these videos. If you're not enjoying them, hey, say something to me. So I thank you, and y'all have a good one. Peace.